Right, so we need to get this domain verified. So at the moment, it's it's saying status isn't. Um, it's saying download the verification file to the hub to the file of the um, the domain. If you've got a website, you can do that. At the moment, I don't have a website for HappyMe.com, so I can't do that. But if you if you get if you can get to your file structure of your website and put in this this uh, file, you just download it and uh, it will verify. Now the other verify is click the verify button or uh, DNS method, right? The other option is to put in a C name or a text field that looks for this. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm with GoDaddy. It'd be really cool if uh, if they had an integration that just linked. I'm going to sign into my account, visit my products, go to uh, happyme.com. And I'm going to add that C name, right? So it's saying here, so uh, sign in domain management, uh, the C name record as given. So you're going to copy this. You're going to go add C name. The host is ZB1 and the value is Zoho verify. And I would change this to custom 600, which is the less it can be, which is six minutes. Right, so it will. It may take around six to 10 minutes for it to take. I think it's also worth putting the text file in as well, just to see if it goes. Um, leave, the, leave the host as blank or um, at. You will have to put at if you're on GoDaddy. Um, so this time I'm gonna do add txt file host is at. Uh, the value is that that verify, and again, I'm going to take the the time down so it updates in six minutes. All right, so that's what you need to do as far as that. Like I said, if you do it the the other way, you would have to put the file on your um, website for it to pick it up, and then click verify. It doesn't take straight away, right? Uh, and some people have had trouble doing this where it hasn't taken for. A long time which is why I would suggest making that you know 600 seconds six minutes right so I'm gonna pause you and I'm gonna come back again hopefully what time are we on now five past three when it's taken all right I'll just click it again for now so it is it is the little bit of the the painful part of doing it it would be cool if GoDaddy if um, Zoa one had more Google way of doing it where you verify versus Google Analytics or something like that, the way Google Webmaster does it, it takes a lot quicker. But once you've passed this stage, you'll be flying. It can just slow you down though. So I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so I've given it 10 minutes. Let's see, DNS method, and it worked. So if you're having issues, make sure that you keep this number down to 600. I think that's the minimum you can do it on GoDaddy. If you can do it shorter, I know on Cloudflare you can do two minutes and that will make it better. If that's the case, then just, just keep that number down and it should verify quicker. If it says something like 1,000 hours or 1,000 minutes or 10,000 minutes sometimes, it may take a day to verify. You know, it says an hour here and stuff like that. So you want to change that. All right, so that's how to verify your domain. Next, we're going to start setting up Zoho Mail and um, setting up that first email address.